Howdy y'all. It's been a long time since I made a video, but with the preview video of my uh, latest character, Krillin, I've gotten a lot of comments and um, a lot of people are happy that I'm back. Um, truth be told, I've never left. I just haven't made anything recently. But um, so one of the comments uh, pretty much said to uh, copy and move from one character to the next. And he gave specific characters. So I'm going to go over that, um, those two characters and uh, show you how it can be done. Now, the one thing to always be remember uh, when you're making a character or if you're copying from another character, if you're copying sprites, it's never gonna come out too good because of palettes, but if you're copying moves, it has a better chance of coming out. So first off, I'm gonna show you that the character that he wants me to copy is um, Mother Brain's Lava that rises. Uh, you're going to see the lava at some point in time. It's going to rise up from the bottom of the stage. And I muted the, com the computer's audio for the sake of recording and everything. And as you can see, the lava is coming up right here. So now he wants to put that into Onslaught as an extra move. So what you do is first you locate the move, which in um, Mother Brain's case, it is State 1006. Acido. I'm assuming that means acid. So you're going to copy the entire thing. Went too far. Uh, there. Okay. I actually just cut it, but the same thing. And then you paste it in the character you're going to put it in. And always have to change the state depths. Uh, number so it doesn't coincide with anything he may have or may not have in this case I'm going to continue the numbering phrase here uh, 10 12 Okay As you can see it's here, but it's not displaying and it's not displaying because the um, The group and index are not correct. So I have to fix that. So it's just gonna be three 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 so now Onslaught has the acid and the yellow box is the hit box, this code. Okay, so now that's that, but we need to fix the number. So I'm going to copy that, paste it here and make this four. Now go to Onslaught's coding and there we go. Make it match. Good. So now Onslaught has the states. He has the animation. He has the sprites. All he needs now is the trigger to make this helper um, appear to do what it's got to do. The tricky thing is um, finding in Mother Brain where that uh, helper is. Um, sometimes you're lucky and you find it easily. I actually searched this earlier and it's in the negative two states. So if I just scroll down here to negative two, you're going to see Mother Brain head, corpo, controno, olho. Boko and somewhere you get the platform, the blah, 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 platform acido. So I'm gonna copy this. I'm gonna put it into onslaughts negative two. Uh, there it is, negative two. Just for testing purposes, I'm just putting it in here just like this. So basically, the trigger is num helper 1006, which is this one, which I have to change to um, a higher number or at least a number I don't think is going to be used. So let's go with, uh, I don't know, 1125. I hope that's not used. That would ruin it. All right. So if uh, helper 1125, which is this helper, is less than or equal to zero, it will spawn a helper. And it has to make sure the round is only round one because uh, Mother Brain is only in the casing in the first stage, and Onslaught's only standing in the first stage. All right, so that's that, and now let's gonna we're gonna try out Onslaught, see if he summons the lava from below. Okay, I see a Sentinel, which I'm assuming <gasps> I forgot the most important thing. Silly me, I forgot to assign it to the proper state. That's why he appeared like that. Okay. And there. I could probably use the same ID number actually for every, there we go. That, that, that should definitely work now. <clears throat> so let's see uh, if it works. 
So far, nothing. Shaking. That means the helper is activated. Now we just gotta wait for the uh, lava to start rising. I'm not sure how long this would take, honestly. Oh, there it is. Lava. Oh, it's killing him. Why? Why would Onslaught do this to him? <laughs> All right, so now it's working. That's great. But um, the guy asked if it could be an extra command. So the best way to do is to make this a command type of move. Um, on Onslaught, the, um, the Z button <clears throat> is not used. So I'm going to use the Z button. So it'll all be it'll be all of this. I'm just gonna put and and command equals Z. Uh, yeah. Okay. I think that'll work. Okay. So everything's fine. I'm gonna speed time up. No lava's rising. I I made the game faster. Okay, and now I'm going to press Z. Oh, everything's shaking. It's only a matter of time until lava rising. And there you go. That's how you copy and move from one character to the next. So first, you have to copy the codes. And I took the code out of this one. You copy the code into the character. Then you copy the sprites. You copy the animation. And you copy the trigger. In this case, the trigger is a negative two state um, helper. Depending on what it is, it can be different. But that's pretty much that. Um, goodbye.